Okay, here's a quick Blender lesson that I meant to mention in the previous video, and this is for new Blender users because this is one area that I've always found that was really interesting about Blender, and that was, let's see, this, this rendered image right there of this particular scene. Well, if you're over here where the camera button is and you want to render an image, you would think that just by pressing the render button, like there, it would render it. Well, it actually would render it. It would render it based on the settings that you have down here in this tab. So it has render setting at 250. Here it's just automatically rendering up to a level of 50 samples like that. But see, if I want to actually do a real render, let me just drop that down to 20 because it, that, so it won't take as long. Well, if I click the render button, it'll render it, sure enough. Let me see. Okay, so it's working away, but it won't render it to a file. So if you want to render it to a file, what I've done is you come down here and I specify a directory here, which I've done in this case like this. But by default, it's, it comes up to a slash TMP directory for a uh, Windows platform. So you specify the directory where you want your file to go. You have to make sure you specify a file type, and I'm using a PNG file. And then if you want to render a single image, what you have to do is you have to go pick a frame. Like well, here, I'm, I've moved it up to the timeline to frame 97. So I set the start and the end frame at 97. And then when I actually want to render it, I actually click the animation button. Because if you don't, you, if you just click the render button, it will render a nice image to the screen, but it won't render it to a file. So you have to click the animation button, and then it'll render frame 97 as a PNG file to that directory. All right, well, that's it for this lesson. Because this is something that, that drove me crazy when I was first learning Blender. It's like, well, that doesn't make any sense, but that's how you do it. All right, well, that's it for this one, and I'll see you in the next video.